Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Ini di sini ada show ini. How to do this one? To do validity test with corrected item total correlation technique with SPSS. So, uh, why this validity test is obligated to us as a researcher? Because this validity test is uh, to measure or to describe the variables that are being studied precisely and accurately. So, according to Jonathan Sarwono, since taking the decision in the validity test of the corrected item total technique at a significance of 5%, that can be based on the following provisions with this condition. If the value of R count is bigger than critical R, uh, which is 0.30, then the questionnaire items are declared as valid. Meanwhile, if the value of R count uh, less than R critical, which is 0 0.30, then the questionnaire items are declared invalid. So the uh, the questionnaire or the question on the questionnaire it should be deleted, or we can replace it with new question. But if we are replacing with new question, there are more time, there are uh, more uh, sacrifice that we should do. So I prefer to delete the questionnaire or the question itself. So how to do the validity test using SPSS? First of all, we have to open the SPSS itself. So I'm using SPSS Statistic 17.0. Okay, just close. So I already have the data, which is uh, it's already spread to 34 samples person so I'm using uh, three variables which is uh, this one is discipline and competence and the other one is uh, performance so how to count the validity of this questionnaire so as you see on my screen there is question number one in variable one question number one up to question uh, 16 so we have to copy this number which are the answers from the respondents copy it and then we paste it on the data view on SPSS so here we are uh, question number one up to question number 16 question number 16 and we can rename this uh, question which may be question number one question number two but we can also uh, replace it on uh, Microsoft Word. So I prefer not to rename this uh, name which which are already on the SPSS. Just we have to change this one to zero. Okay. We delete this one because the question is up to number 16. So, how to do the validity test with this uh, technique? The first step is we have to click the analyze and then scale and then reliability analysis. So, we have to control all and then we move them into these items and we click the statistics. And then we have to click the scale if item deleted. So just click continue and then OK. 
Okay, we are waiting the result. So, as we see here, we see two tests in one step. The first one is reliability statistics. It means uh, the test of reliability. And what we do now is just to see how we do the uh, validity test. So, we have to focus on this. Uh, on this column, corrected item total correlation. All the questions are more than 0 0.3, so it means all the uh, question on these questionnaires are valid. This one.